Hi, I am Pixel Pia. Today we're going to continue taking a look at how we can create a podcast using the Anchor app. And today we're going to add background music and music between segments. But before we do that, I want to share with you two methods of editing that we couldn't do on our Android mobile phone. Let's start by taking a look at what we can do using the web browser. So here we are at Anchor on the web. If you want to do this using your mobile device, you need to use a web browser in desktop mode. Let's say that I want to edit my blah blah section here. I click on the three little dots and shows edit audio. This is the waveform. So let's do a cut here. I can choose to split. And as you see up here, this is blah blah one of two. And this is two of two, just as we did yesterday. Let's split at a couple of more places. Let's try to cut out that part that is quiet. Now we have one of four, two of four, three of four, and four of four. As you can see up here, there is a little trash can. If I click that, it gets gray. This means that that part will not be saved when I later on go to save. Now I need to make this a little larger here by using the little plus sign down here. And now I can see the trash can on part three of four as well. So I can click that. So now I have two gray areas. Those are areas I want to cut out. So now I go to save and it will ask me save as multiple segment. That would mean that I save this as one segment and this part as the second segment or I can save those two combined to one segment where these darker areas are cut out and that's what I'm gonna do right now save as one segment okay I said that we have an advantage on iOS we can't do all the parts we did on the web the cutting out parts in the middle of a segment but we have if we take a look at the end here you can choose edit audio and that works exactly the same way as it did on the Android but we have trim start and end points so here we have the start and we have the end let's take the start and drag it into where I want this segment start do the same with the end drag that in and now if I have hit save the iOS app will cut out these two gray parts let's look at how we can add background music and let's start with the intro these things works the same whether you are on an iPhone or an Android so I click the three little dots and shows add background music this is three little segments you can use and what background music will do is it will add a little bit of music that tones down fades out when you start talking no music behind your segment but it fades in again at the end of the segment and add a little bit music at the bottom you saw i scroll down because I like this part. Spunk lit. That was a little example, so let me now add it to my intro. And now you see this little gray corner here with a couple of music notes. That means that background music is added to this part. So let's listen. So this is the easiest way to record. I also said that we can add music between segments and say that I want some music between me and blah blah. I hit the little plus sign and to the left here you see music. Anchor is part of Spotify and if you click here you can add Spotify music. For several reasons 
I don't recommend to use this and I have already made a video about that that I will link down in the description. Instead I want to go to interludes, the pink background. Here are music, short little music pieces, you see a couple of seconds and here we have spunk lit again so let's continue with the same i hit the plus sign add interlude to episode and i close it now we are back here and as always when i add a segment a music piece or whatever it is it ends up at the end so i have to hold it down and move it up to the space where i wanted it to be and save so now i have it between me and blah blah so let's play it from here. They are for my tutorial on YouTube. This is how easy it is. So that's how you can add music as background music or between segment. Tomorrow, we're gonna, I'm going to show you how you can prepare this single episode for publishing and how to publish. Hey, Doa.